Welcome! In this tutorial, I'll show you how to connect to your Microsoft SQL Server database so that you can immediately start exploring and visualizing your data. Adding a SQL Server data source is easy. It requires a one-time installation of the Explore Analytics agent on a Windows computer with access to your database. For the purpose of this video, we assume that the agent is already installed and running. Let's add a SQL Server data source. We'll give the data source a name. This can be any name that will identify the data source for us. And let's also give it a description. In our demo, the database is running on the Amazon cloud. Let's select that agent. Our agent is installed on the same server. Therefore, the host name is simply localhost. We will be using integrated authentication. It means that we log into SQL Server using the identity of the Windows account on which the agent is installed. Therefore, we don't need to specify any username or password. Finally, we'll choose the Northwind database. This is a demo database in SQL Server. Explore Analytics connects to the data source and discovers all the tables and their fields. It will also discover references between tables if your database has those defined. Otherwise, we can define those references later. We're now ready to explore. Here are all the tables of the Northwind database. For example, here are the fields of the orders table. Notice that some fields reference other tables. This allows us to seamlessly query across multiple tables. With Explore Analytics, it's easy to visualize data using a timeline chart. For example, sales by quarter by product category. Or using a map chart. For example, sales by country. That's it for this tutorial. To learn more about how to analyze and visualize data using Explore Analytics, we invite you to watch the other video tutorials and to visit our website at exploreanalytics.com. Thank you.